，李白，李白 ，also known as 青莲居士 ，hermit of green lotus and a banished immortal, had a bright and friendly personality. He loved to make friends, drink, and write poems, and was highly accomplished in poetry of various forms, such as 乐府 poems, folk song style, 歌行 a variant of 乐府 poems with seven-syllable verses, and 绝句 quatrains. As a great romantic poet of the Tang Dynasty, he is praised as a mortal poet. By later generations, since he was young, Li Bai has been intelligent. At the age of fifteen, he had already written many poems. Keen on swordsmanship, he was gallant and chivalrous. He left his hometown when he was young, traveling around and making many friends, including the erudite Meng Haoran. During this time, Li Bai's poems were fresh, bright, and beautiful, with free strokes and ingenious metaphors. He created many works that have been passed down through the ages, such as "Thoughts on a Tranquil Night," "Seeing Meng Haoran Off at the Yellow Crane Tower," and "The Waterfall in Mount Lu Viewed from Afar." Thoughts. On a tranquil night, before my bed, a pool of light. Can it be hoar frost on the ground? Looking up, I find the moon bright. Bowing, in homesickness, I'm drowned. Throughout his life, Li Bai. Unwillingly pursued the ideal of making the people live in peace and tranquility, and retiring while the country embracing peace and stability. But the darkness of reality shattered his dreams, and the constraints of the feudal and hierarchical system suffocated him. As a result, he indulged in wine and wild songs. Sought immortality and studied Taoism. He also lamented the difficulty of the way of the world. He wrote the poem, "The road to Shu is harder than scaling the sky afar." To express his frustration, melancholy, and dissatisfaction for being unrecognized for his talents, still he remained to be unyielding, confident. And stand fast in his pursuit of ideals, and had hope in frustration. Hard is the way of the world. Pure wine in golden cup costs ten thousand coins. Good. Choice dish in a jade plate is worth as much nice food. Pushing aside my cup and chopsticks, I can't eat. Drawing my sword and looking round, I hear my heart beat. I can't cross the Yellow River; ice has stopped its flow. I can't climb mountain Taihang; the sky is blind with snow. I poise a fishing pole with ease on the green stream. Or set sail from the sun like a sage in a dream. Hard is the way, hard is the way. Don't go astray, wither today. A time will come to ride the wind and cleave the waves. I'll set my cloud-like sail to cross the sea, which raves. In order to realize his life ideals, Li Bai presented Ming Tang Fu, Ode to the Hall of Light, and Da Lie Fu, Ode to the Great Hunting, and was appointed as an official of the Imperial Academy. He wrote poems for the entertainment of Emperor Xuanzong, 
and a song of pure happiness, consisting of three poems. He wrote by imperial order was appreciated by the emperor. Later, due to drunkenness, he asked the eunuch Gao Li Shi to remove his boots, which resulted in false accusations and his being exiled and stripped of his title. Then he met Du Fu, and they formed a deep friendship. Li Bai's works during this period, such as Mount Skyland Ascended in a Dream, A Song of Farewell and Invitation to Wine, expressed his frustration at not being recognized for his talents, and his contempt and rebellion against the ruling class. The beautiful lady Yang, Li Bai. Her robe is made of cloud. Her face a flower made. Caressed by vernal breeze, freshened by morning dew. Charming as fairy queen in her mountain of jade. Or goddess of the moon in her palace, sky blue. In his later years, Li Bai was exiled and lived a miserable life. In On Deathbed, he reviewed and summarized his life, expressing his great nostalgia for life and deep regret for not being able to make full use of his talents. On Deathbed, when files the rock, he shakes the world. In mid-air, his weakened wings are furled. The wind he's raised still steers the sea. He hung his left wing on some side tree. Posterity, my here, oh here. Confusion stared. Who will shed a tear? Li Bai had remarkable achievements in poetry, calligraphy, and swordsmanship. He created the ancient Romantic literature style, the peak of Ge Xin style the poems, and the seven character quatrains, which opened up a new chapter for the prosperity and development of Tang poetry, and had a huge impact on future generations.